has come to our family. We are going to die. No. Ah, that dude's going to kill us. We're going to die. I think he comes with the pyre. What I'm saying is I think it's him and the pyre on the board at the same time. Because it says he likes to throw you at the pyre and watch you burn. We're going to die. Yeah, we're going to die. We're going to die level two and be failures for the rest of our lives. No, he's start the campaign over. <clears throat> okay. Well, until we start the campaign over. All right, so here we go. We are now in the hamlet. So if you use uh, your personal skills, your personal hamlet skills, you will suffer four turns of debuffing. Wonderful. So here we are, hamlet events in good spirits. With spirits lifted and head held high, eager and resolute, the heroes marched to their doom. <laughs> That's actually pretty thematic right now. Uh, each hero rolls a ten-sided die. The hero or heroes that rolls the highest gain a virtue. Wow. All right. We'll start with the grave robber. That's a nine. Oh, highwayman. And baby! Crusader. Two. <clears throat> Eight. So that means the highwayman. So the trick about gaining a virtue is... Shove these up because there's. Mm -hmm. Is your. You have a virtue Focused. for the whole thing? At your, the start of your turn, roll a 10 sided die. If I get a 1 to 5, I get buffed for two turns. Yep, but this starts. On the red side. Really? Yeah. So, wait, if I get two, I'm dead? Yeah, so we need to heal that shit. That stuff. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, something like that. Okay. Um, okay. These go away. <clears throat> Those go away. These go away. Mm. Oops. This goes away. And uh, <clears throat> this goes away and turns man. into a negative quirk. Man, oh man. So I'm nocturnal and I'm a bad gambler. So that's a really bad combo because most, you know, gambling will proliferate at night so oh so actually when you let me take that back when you go to the graveyard and you gain a virtue for the next run you can do the exact same thing you can actually pick up a virtue and push but it does it actually pushes you up so you're correct so that would be the same effect as the graveyard so it would have pushed you to the zero oh okay so, yeah all right well that's that's not so bad okay and otherwise two would really be yeah bad. that's super bad all right and we'll roll for the I was going to say Crypt Keeper for the Groundskeeper. Eight. He wants to block the Blacksmith. So So we can't... Uh, what does the Blacksmith do? It's a uh, uh, one-time dodge or... One-time dodge or big damage boost. Okay, that's not that big of a deal. All right, so what do we need? You need to heal. I have... Well... <coughs> 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 Both of my dudes need to heal in a very major way. Well, Good thing we have three days. Pick one. You don't get all three. What? <laughs> Because okay. I'm almost, I'm three away from Death's Door here, and I am at Death's Door over so here. let's have him heal, and let's yeah. have him get rid of Quirks, maybe. He needs to go here. Yeah. So I'll pay three and heal ten. Yeah. Now, oh, we don't have enough to upgrade that, unfortunately. Be we nice. don't? Well, we could spend twenty, but we'd be down to four bucks. No, yeah, that's not going to make it. Okay. 
Okay. And so and you want to get rid of those. I need to do quirks. So come over here to the Five Abbey. More bucks. And get both. Get rid of both of those. Why do we always take care of your characters? Um. How much do I have to pay in town to get a new foot? <laughs> <laughs> Do we have a cobbler? <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm talking, I'm calling to devs tomorrow. We need a cobbler in, in the hamlet. Blacksmith is busy. All right. Well, I'm going to go here with the Vestal. And oh, I don't know if I want to upgrade a skill or if I want to upgrade the Vestal. Oh, but I think that gives her more movement, which it does not. Dang it. But it does give her a dodge. I'm almost tempted to just upgrade a heal instead of a... I'm going to do it. I'm going to upgrade um, one of my skills for two. <coughs> do your trinkets... Two. Um, they turn back to flip the Flip back side. over, yep. yeah. Okay. I'm going to spend two. I'm going to get one of my skills. And i got to spend two dollars with that. Mm. Two gold. And then for the grave robber, I would love to go here, but I can't. I don't need to heal stress. Um, two provision dice, we good? Yeah. Is that enough money left over? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So she'll take an extra two provision dice. Okay, good idea. Alright, so that's day one. <clears throat> On to day two. I need to heal some daggum stress. Right, well, let's roll and see where that groundskeeper would like to go. Zeben. He wants to go to the guild. No teaching today, unfortunately. Mm, 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 mm. Both of my dudes need to heal up something fierce. Now, mm -hmm. if we remove stress at this point, it will flip back over to white? It will not. It will not. you just got this. So his flipped over to white as soon as he turned that in. In those, in those two. Okay, yep. so he's good. But and he can't heal any he more goes. stress. That's okay, it. no no worries that way. Um, so. He needs to go heal. Two, three bucks for ten health. <laughs> You're not even close. No, I'm, I'm, wow. I'm eleven health now. All right. I have what actually else? I have thirteen health to take. Um, negative quirks. We only have one on the board. So if you could upgrade the Abbey, if we could have done that, then we could actually buy positive quirks. Hmm. Um, but so I mean we don't have a lot of money left to go around. Mm hmm. What is it? I take a debuff for four turns? Yes. And I can heal stress. I think she's going to go... I'm going to take the debuff for four turns. Wow. Everybody's going to heal the stress. She doesn't get hurt very much anyway. No. She's, she's, she's rarely the target of an attack. Right. So and everybody's going to get that and get a buff for three turns. Sweet. So we'll fight back. And then, what's your guy gonna do, Highwayman? Highwayman, I'm I'm thinking real hard about um, about um, doing a couple more provision dice. I think. <clears throat> Never hurts. Um, we but need, I'm wondering. We need another yeah, three need, bucks for that. Three bucks for that. So well, probably three it. six. We need to end up with at least three bucks. So that's not bad. Okay. So we'll do that and get a couple more provision dice. You can pass those over. Okay. That leaves us with eight. I'm just going to go two bucks and remove a quirk since I don't really want this thing. That'll put us in our last day and our last bit of dough. So well, ahead, I think he's just going to stay here and use three more bucks. Okay. And then... Well... You gotta roll this first. No, that's true. As long as you don't roll a four. Ten. Right on. No mad wagon. So you used. I used three. So there should be uh, three left. You gave me a. Was there. There was six total? There was a five there. There was a five. And I used three. So you put two in. You're good. Oh, okay. Yeah, there was a, there was a, five, there was a, and a five and a one. Okay. And you put two in. So we could have somebody go and upgrade over here, their hero card. Upgrade a hero or to to uh, upgrade a effect. 
I could upgrade a dice, if, or I mean, I wouldn't mind upgrading a skill, or you could upgrade a skill. You can choose, I suppose. 50-50. Well, you get to. No, you go ahead and do it. I was thinking about going to get a virtue for the cruise. Oh, uh, no. He's already got one. He's already got Crusader's already gone, so. <sighs> so he can upgrade one of his things? One of, either him or the... Or one of the three can. That's pretty much all we got left. Well, if I... I'll either upgrade a heal or upgrade my poison So the dark. buff thing, the debuff thing, only gives plus one per turn, right? Per for round? For crits against us, that's correct. No. For crits against us? For one stack. Now if you have a second stack, oh, which I'm thinking you, I forgot to pick that. So if you have a stack of four, then the monsters have a plus four crit against you? No, they have a plus one crit against you. For, for four, four turns. turns. Got it. So okay. if you had two stacks, it would be plus two crit against you. Got it, got it, got it. All right, well, this is what I am going to do then, I think, because I'm going to clean my guns. We are all at the edge of our seats. I'm going to clean my guns. Oh, right on. That'll give me four, four debuffs, and then it will give me a stack of six buffs. Right on. So I'm going to have three turns where I get plus two to crit. We're going to have to uh, get, get. Uh, I know. No, you'll just have to, um, you said a stack of six? Yeah. I'll use these shields over here. They're the same colors. Oh, you got it? Well, no, not really, but it pretends. It makes a good pretend. How much is it? Got it. How many have you got here? You got... Oh, I see. I see what you did. I just grabbed a stack. All right, I am going to upgrade poison darts then. To three blight for three turns. It's going to cost us two bucks, two experience. Now, this experience here helps us if we ever need to bring somebody out from the stagecoach, right? Yeah, so if somebody ever came from the stagecoach, they would start with that many skills worth of upgrades. Skills or levels. Cool. Oh, I healed. We paid for this. We did. I'm good to go, man. Alright, we're all good to go. Let's do it. <laughs> Moving on. How do I get rid of these diseases? Oh, right. Oh, right you... there where you heal. Yeah, well. Okay. We for another day. Left. We'll keep that dollar right there to show how rich we are. Hey, this ain't about the money, man. We get ten bucks about... for going back in. That's for bravery. <laughs> you guys are so brave. Here's ten dollars. Hope you come back alive. <laughs> All right. I already pulled this card up top. It's our quest. Clear the path. The path ahead in the ruins is littered with fearsome terrors and nightmarish cults. Put an end to them. Clear the path once and for all. We get one experience point for every two rooms cleared. Hmm, interesting. So, so if we're gonna go with our two experience point thing here, clear four rooms. We gotta clear four rooms. One. I don't think that's gonna happen. We got brother. two treasure rooms here. That's forty bucks if we can get it. Forty yeah. gold. Yeah. Need no bucks here. <laughs> a trap and a darkness. There we go. Jeez. Read them and weep. Yeah, read them and weep is right. Check the bones. And this is a nasty dungeon layout. Okay. Brave adventurers we are. <clears throat> For now. When danger reared its ugly head, Sir Robin bravely turned and fled. Yes. That's what I feel like. We got this. All right. You gotta roll our provision dice, man. See how badly this is going to be. Look at all those DDs. Double Ds. Oh, look at all these wounds. Oh, these mm. <laughs> wounds. Oh, oh. Wound wow. fixers. <laughs> no bleed tonight. So, um, I say shovel. you do shovels and I do torches. Right on. Shovel. That's three shovels. 
Mm -hmm. Three torches. That's a lot of provisions. Not so bad. All right, let's explore that first oh, tunnel. Oh dear. All right, highwayman. Oh no. Crusader. Wow. Dang. We are loving those. Dang. All of them are shovel items. All of them? All of them. Mmm. And you're the only one with one health. Everybody else is six, six, seven. All right. Nice. He'll take it. So I got to roll. One attack. Hi. No. No, but that's four damage. You're level two? Yeah. Four damage. Faux damage. Faux damage. Faux damage. And then are we burning three shovels? Yeah, you guys need to, right? And then I'm I'm at seven. Uh, so. Might as well. Yeah. We're shovelless. We just dug ourselves out of a big pit of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> big pit of stuff. All right. Oh, before that, I guess we would have, we meant to explore or to scout. Yeah. And then we traveled to that cool little treasure room. So Treasure. 20 gold in there if we can handle it. Yeah, we can handle it. We got this. A healing Ooh, fountain. healing waters. Heroes ending their turn here gain three health. Not bad. It depends on if we can kill anything while we're on our way. <laughs> That's it? Yep. That is that. But it's upside down. Bing. Depends on whose perspective you're looking at. Our perspective. Alright. The only one that matters. Ooh, we've got to split up the team here. Look oh, at this. Guess what? Your favorite guy's back. No, not the rattler. Rattler is on the prowl. All right. Bone courtier. This whole dungeon, <clears throat> this whole place is full of those little dudes. Where did you go, Mr. Bone courtier? Do we have any... I don't know why I lose him in there. That's really strange. What? It's a treasure room, but there's no treasures. No, it's a healing fountain room. Okay. That's the treasure. Ooh, a brigand blood letter. Oh no. We have his model if you want to use it. Well, at least he's a level one monster with 24 hit points. If he was level two, he'd be a boss. We have his model if you want to use it. Sure. Yeah. Big ugly. <laughs> right there. Snap. Okay. All right, there we go. That is a 22 health, a 24 health, and Dang. a little 7 health in the back. 22. It's his bleed that really sucks. Yes. Okay. We need to go and do some sparkle fingers on that rat. We, we each get our three marks at the beginning. Do Although, they need it? No. They do not need it. Okay, so we don't need to worry about it. Okay. All right, here we go. Crusaders first. Mm -hmm. And he's slow as ever. Yeah, he is. Man, I, <laughs> I feel bad. Um, I'm gonna... Did I level something up that I forgot to level up? You probably did. You did level something up. I leveled that up. So we have three, six, eleven. We had eleven between the last, and I spent six. So I spent four. Huh. This sounds kind of strange, but I'm going to use my speed stone. I get up here to this rattler and I'm going to try to do stunning blow on it so that it does not get to do anything if it gets called. Okay. So, and then next turn I'm going to hit it with a smite and a stunning blow, hopefully. We'll see. Nine accuracy, so seven accuracy. What in the world? 
keep missing it by one. And you lose a. Uh, yep. Use this. Wow. I'm so bad at this game. This game's so bad at being nice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Highwayman's next. Uh, Highwayman's <clears throat> way over here. He's got that brigand blood letter staring him in the face. Mm -hmm. And uh, he stares back. He stares back, is right. So, looks like we'll do um, pistol. Shh. We'll move one, two over here and then do pistol shot. Which is accuracy nine, crit one, two, three, so crit three. Nice. So that's a nine damage. Wow. Oh, so he moved first? Oh, so you can heal. Hmm. Yes. Got yes, it. that's correct. That's those two. And so then you heal three? Or did you already do that? Uh, no. At end, end of my turn? End of your turn, I think. Okay. End of their turn, yep. Uh, that's really nice. One, two. Okay. The Rattler's turn. And he would like to... Do a warning rattle. <laughs> nice. He's doing a warning rattle. He's buffing himself for two. He is. Oh, he's shielding. Oh, oh I have shield, sorry. Mm -hmm. And plus one repost. Which means that he draws attacks in the space. If there was other things there, you'd have to attack him. Got it. That's what the shield post. means? Yes. Your post is when you do damage to him in the space, you take two damage So back. he didn't actually do anything. He just he did, did not. That. He just okay. buffed himself. All right, all right, all right. Rattling. Don't let me do that again. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Blood letters next. He's in the defensive position. And he wants to do punishment to the closest. So that would be to you. Wait. Yeah, I just shot him in the face. No. Nope. Two spaces away. Same either direction. So he wants to do a punishment. So accuracy eight modified crit chance one. Oh, remember our we have a dodge, so accuracy set seven. Nice. Ah. Fantastic. Okay, Grave Robber's turn. She is now, doesn't have a target anymore. Hmm. Burn a buff. I'm gonna go two spaces. Try to heal my leg. And shh, <laughs> I'm sorry. And is he resistant? He is resistant to blight. Although my Blight still now does three for three turns. I think I'm still gonna do it to him. I'm gonna do the Poison Dart. Accuracy's 11, minus two, so accuracy's nine, crit chance one. Okay. Got it. That's a three, three damage. Mm -mm -mm. And three Blight for two turns. Come on now. Three Blight instead of Instead of uh, three bite for two turns, instead of three bite for three? Yeah. Got it. Yep. Okay. And the Bone Courtier goes next. He's in the back. He wants to do a Tempting Goblet against the most stressed, which is typically you. Yes, that's you. <laughs> Just saying. I don't know what, about, what it is about it, but... Um, so he needs to be two spaces away. He is. One, two. 
Um, okay, so crit eight, accuracy 10, so accuracy 8, crit gen 0. All right, and you will take one stress. Ooh. Yeah, Crusader. All right. That's that. that means the Vestal's turn. Yeah. So you got five health. Oh, she should have healed how many? Three? Three. Um, Vestal is then going to come forward and do a dazzling light at that s rattler. Stun, 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 stun. Yep. Magazine 9, chance 1. Down, down, or down. Nope. I meant nope. I didn't mean yep. <laughs> it's okay. He's still there. Okay. As long as I go first, then everything will be okay. That's it. 1, 2, 3, 4. Mm. Round two already. I think we did all right for round two. For round one. Round one. That crit on the blood letter. Yeah, that was good. Made it okay. Just that one thing. Huh? But no, the three blight, the the the, the uh, yeah. stack of two three blights. That's going to be good too. Yep. <clears throat> but all right, Crusader is next. Oh. Oh, now you get a whale on it. Kitty, kitty, kitty. So, All right, here we go. One of your counters, please. Yep. So I have plus one crit. So, spite one. It's going to be uh, plus one crit. Accuracy, Accuracy seven. nine, seven. Yep. Yeah, so it hits. That's seven damage. He is not unholy, he's a beast. Okay. Yeah. So, seven damage. And then and stunning you blow. Take two damage back. Why? For the repost. Jerk. Stunning blow. Accuracy seven. Crit one. Crit. <laughs> so you get. I get that. And then that's eight damage. And. One stun. So is it? I just, I just dinged you on the head. And stunned, and you take two damage. Okay. All right. Nice. Not bad. Highwayman's turn. Highwayman. So he's at eighteen. He's gonna take three from this hit to put him at twenty-one. So really, he's going to tick down before he gets to do anything. Okay. Good. So, knew we can leave him alone. Mm -hmm. Alright. Um, we'll go one, two over here. Actually, should we go over here? Does it matter? No. Except for he likes to hit crowded spaces. So Okay. So it's better to stay spread out. Yeah, best we can. Okay. Alright, so he'll do that and then he'll do pistol shot. Um crit one, two, three. Mm-hmm. So crit three. Um, Give me one of those negatives too. Accuracy. Accuracy. One no of the dodge. negatives? Oh, one of these. Gotcha. Actually, one from last time too. He has zero dodge? Zero dodge. Okay, so accuracy nine. Got him. So that's just five damage. Five. Fourteen. Ten left to go. Mm -hmm. That's your turn? Yeah, moved and shot. Alright, yeah, give me one more of these while you're at it. For your first turn. Okay. Okay, oh, not his turn. His turn. So he's gonna lose one of each, including one stun, three damage. Uh, 
That puts him at 15. Huh? 16? 18. 21. 21? Yeah, that's why I said he's going to tick down. When he's he going to bleed out. When next he takes turn. that three damage, he's going next turn. Okay, Grave Robert's turn. All right, now. Do you have free movement? She's we do want to stay spread out, huh? She needs to stop laying down on the job. I know. Don't tell her that. <laughs> All right. So I think I'm just going to run straight forward. He is at 14. I'm going to, well, actually, oops, sorry. One, two, three. I'll just go here almost as much as just hitting with the pick in the face. I'm going to throw that poison dart again. Mm -hmm, okay. Accuracy 11, so I can't miss. Crit 2. Okay. 5 is a hit. So 3 damage. That's 4. Sometimes I can't do math. Mm -hmm. And that is 3 blight for 3 turns. the vessel's turn. Mm-mm-mm. And... Crusader's hurt. Mm -hmm. She's hurt. He's not hurt too bad. He's at nine. Okay. So she's going to heal once with Divine Comfort. Okay, so that's two for you and two for her. Danka! And then she's going to heal with Divine Grace, Critical Chance 4, Dang it. for 5 heal. Did you count that? I for, did. For 5 heal? Yeah, because we still are, we're still here. Yeah. 5 heal? 5. Yeah, we don't have the plus 1 from up here yet. You got it. Okay. And that means that he's going next. Going to blight for three. When he takes up two spots like that, it doesn't mean he attacks twice, right? Just no. the first time? Yep. So he's at 20 health. And he is going to do a punishment against the closest. So, Crusader hmm. again. Got it. Accuracy is eight. Oh, seven. Crit chance one. Four. Okay. So that is three damage. Two bleed for two turns. Oof. And one stress. And this is the first time you've taken bleed, but now you get a stack of one bleed for two turns as well. That hemophilia, man. Oh, and you take four damage. Why? Because you take the bleed and you take two damage per hero level and you're level Dang. two. Dang. That's a bad one. It is a bad one. That is no good. No good, sir. Okay. Bone Courtier is last. He wants to... Oh, it doesn't matter. He's going to do the same thing no matter what. He's going to do a Tempting Goblet against the most stressed. You're at four. Still me. <laughs> Our Crusader takes a beating. Okay, he wants to stay two spaces away, which he is. And accuracy is eight, crit zero. All right, that's one more stress. Mm. Harsh. I don't know how much longer this Crusader can work in these harsh conditions. Uh, we'll keep him out. Contacting right. uh, yeah, HR right. next time we go to hunt the Hamlet. Whatever. We'll be uh, talking to uh, Michael. The way it is, it's three to one as far as. I've got the scars to prove it, though. You can't never see the under armor. We just keep <laughs> polishing your armor for you. Oh, or fixing it, repairing it, making sure you look good. Mm -mm -mm. At all times. Okay, round three. 
starting with the Rattler. He is going to bleed, poison, blight, whatever you want to call it. Goodbye. Goodbye, stupid snake. <laughs> stupid snake. Those are yours. Okay. Crusader's up. Okay, Crusader will... I just, uh, zealous accuse him. Yeah, first you're gonna bleed for three. <laughs> bleed for three, that'll give me five. Which means I'm actually at twelve. And that takes these away. Um, and that takes your last buff away too. Yep. Zealously accuse. Um, you accusing that big guy of being dumb? Wait a minute. That was a one. No, we didn't get it. From no, that. we didn't no. get it from that. So yeah, that is a hit though. So it's five, five. damage. And I will do. Battle heal. It's awesome. For my second action. And that heals three. So. Okay. Courtier's next. And he's going to want to do a knife in the dark against the closest. So you. He's going to come visit. Accuracy is seven. Accuracy is five now. Critical chance one. Nice. Missed. Okay. That means Highwayman is next. Okay. Um. He's going to move one, two here. And. Pistol shot, accuracy nine, crit, chance one, yep. two, crit chance two, two. Three. three, Yep. so eight accuracy, three crit. <laughs> oh, Nothing. Let me give me one of those debuffs too. All right, but I am standing here so I can heal three. Yes. All right. So the grave robber's next. So the grave robber is gonna go here. Yeah. She's gonna go there. Lose her last buff, and she might as well just. He has seven health. She's just gonna throw a dagger at him. Accuracy nine. Crit chance three, so accuracy eight. Got him. Okay. Got him, got him, got him. Come on, come on, come on. Damage. Knock that stupid cup out of his hand. <laughs> it ain't stupid. The cup's not stupid whatsoever. And she's gonna heal for three. Okay, that's her turn. Vestal is last. Oh wait, he didn't have a thing? He did, he already went. Oh, he already went? Yeah, I already pulled him. Okay. He already went. We were just running down our I got line. You. I got you. Um, so Vestal's next. Um, she is first going to... She needs to get three on him. Oh, that'll be funny if she doesn't, but that's okay. She's first going to heal. Well, actually, he's still cooking. Oh, Alright, well, she's just going to heal you again then. I'm gonna let this guy go for a Doesn't drop. something stop these bleeds? Yeah, you could burn a bandage to do that. We got four bandages. Let's do it. Should have done it, but when I got it. Well, you can't. You have to do it on your turn. Oh, got it, but. 
Okay. So I, it, it has to affect you once. You would have bled once and then use the bandage. Unless Got you're it. out of battle and you can just do it. Understood. Um, okay. So she's going to heal him once for Divine Grace. Okay. Um, critical Chance. Was that her last? That was her last crit. So Critical Chance 4. Got there it. go. So she gets a stress and he gets 7 health. 7 health? Yeah. Ooh. I feel much better. Thank you, my lady. Now that she did that, she's tempted to try to finish him. Or she can finish just... him. He's in sparkle fingers? No, I think one of us will finish him. She's going to heal you again. She's going to heal you with divine comfort. Okay. Seven, so you heal for two. Got it. She heals for two. Okay. I think we'll stay in the dungeon, man. We feel better at the dungeon than we do at the hamlet. Oh, well, for now. <laughs> for now, we didn't say that last dungeon. No, we did not. Last dungeon was murder. Almost quite Good literally. Luck. He gets to go first. Oof. He wants to do a knife in the dark. Accuracy me. five. Yep. Accuracy five. Crit one. Five is modified. Mm-hmm. Okay. Three damage that time. And then back right down the line. Crusader is first. So. Crusader. Punch him in the neck. Um, or heal first and then punch him in the neck. I will heal first. Battle heal. That nice. is a, Not a crit. regular. Yeah. So it just heals the damage I just took. And then smite one. Accuracy nine, eight. Yep. Crit, nothing. Zero. There it is. Seven damage. Eight, actually. <sighs> Well, what are you doing there, bro? the guards. Eight damage because he's unholy, right? Doing a card trick. Yeah, he only had three health. Well, I still did eight. You don't need to overkill. Curb stomped him after I sliced his head off. Poor little guy. No. Poor little he knew what he was, skeleton he, he, guy. He knew what was happening when he joined up. That's true. He was prepared. Okay. Nice thing about that is we get... 20. Ten. Oh! That puts us at 31. We also get to count that room as one of the... Cleared? Cleared rooms. Hey, where'd our thing go? Oh, it's right here. No. Yeah. Put it up there for now. That's one of our cleared rooms. Okay. And we're all in pretty good shape. Well, he's no, a little, no, we're in good shape. We're good. So, scout? Yeah. Let's do it. Scout, scout. Scout's going to give us a big advantage here. Two curio rooms and a darkness room. Hmm. Going through darkness just drops our torch by one. Curio's going to give us a curio card which we can use torches on to get the good effects. And they do count as rooms towards our experience. These? Yes. I say we do that then. So I'll we'll do, we'll do the middle one and come back down. Just cost us one extra. Sure. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Alright, so hi, Weeman. Great rubber. Oh. Crusader. Oh. We spoke too soon. Oh. This is bad. Alright, starting with Crusader. So that would be a shovel no or shovel. two damage, two stress. Yes, sir. I guess I'm taking it. Okay. Stressful darkness, we either burn a torch, which we kind of want torches for two of those, but, or you get, you don't want, yeah, we need to burn a torch for you, because you're already on second level. Yeah. And we got to remember to do that on your turn. That's true. We Could have been, been buffing. Um, please stay here while we're still in the yep. thing. Those are still uh, there. Okay. So you did yours. I have a stressful darkness. I'm going to take two wonderful stress. Either that or I could let her torch go down one so we could have the crit. I'm good with that. Okay, and then I gotta eat some food or take four damage. Okay. Alright, 
So we found, or we got our way, so we're gonna go in there. We're gonna roll a 10-sided on a one to five. Uh, How about on a nine? On a nine, the room is clear. We just get a curio. On a one to five, we have to have a combat. So we get a curio card. One of us gets to decide who's gonna use it. Oh, you can't do that. I decide. just read the title. <laughs> who's gonna use it? Uh, I don't wanna use it. I read the title. <laughs> <laughs> Give it to the grave robber. She has nothing. She has nothing? She has no bad thing. But I'm still burning a torch for it, so. Okay. Oh, an eldritch altar. You feel a shiver down your spine as you behold the, the, this eldritch altar. A small coin pouch on the base. But as you touch its stony facade, a nauseating feeling overcomes you. Mm. Right <laughs> okay. So I don't take the stress. I don't take the negative quirk. I don't take the debuff. I just we find just a bag 10 of ten bucks. gold. Wow! Look at that. Yep. Oops, sorry. <laughs> no, it's good. It's good. Okay. So that's that. So then we've completed another room. We got to take one stress to back up. Mm. Mm mm mm. All right, and then we're going that way. So we got to do an explore. Hi, women. <laughs> Nice, I got a zero finally. Oh, oh. wow. Oh, man. Okay, so you either got to burn a torch, lower our torch, or take two stress. Um, this is on this one, right? Mm-hmm. <coughs> uh, lower the torch. All right. And then I'll burn a torch for this one. Unless we want to keep it to do this. Well, I don't know if we want him five away from having a heart attack. Okay. Yeah, so we'll have to so take just the, burn the torch. We'll take the repercussions, yep. Got it. Alright, so I don't have this, so I gotta roll an attack with a trap. Oh Ooh, that's a critical. So at level two that is six damage. Ouch. Man. Traps. I stuck my foot right in it. That's why it came <laughs> off. <laughs> Sorry, it's going to be a running joker now. So now we're here. Nothing there. So now we are there. So we D10. Roll. 1 to 5, there's a combat encounter. That's not straight. That was either a 1 or a 9. Okay. Yeah, it's just a card. So Curio, so who's going to take it? Um... There is no coming back from this one, so not. I can take it. Graver, the highwayman, because that we got a whole bunch of bad stuff over here. Yeah, a little bit of bad stuff. That's lot, really bad. A lot of good stuff right here. That's really no, bad. And you're already. And if I eat food, it's right. stressful. Grave robber says, "I'll do it." The confession booth. No, nope, she gives it back. <laughs> now, forsaken for. Uh, my tongue doesn't work. <laughs> a forsaken confession booth. It has been you. It hasn't been used in years. As you step inside, you feel a faint chill, followed by a painful sting. You should not have sat down. That's all I know. <laughs> As you shake the poisonous spider off your garment, your vision is blurred, and you feel weak. This is gonna hurt. All right, I get one stress. I get a negative quirk. I am now nervous. So every time I get stressed, I get another stress. You nervous in the service. Yep. I get a blight for three turns. So two turns because of my resistance. We got a potion that can take care of that, though. And I get a disease. You get a disease. You get a disease. Everybody gets a disease. I got lethargy. Hey, the highwayman knows how you feel. Mm -hmm. So now when I move, just wake I'm up kind of damage. Not Slow, wanting to do life this sluggish, week. Sluggish, man. He understands. Look at this. So we know we got four items left. We got forty-one bucks. Just, all right. But we're only one room away we're from our two, and we can go. Away. All right, let's do it. Scout. Yes, I'm red. Give me one of those stupid things. All right, there you go. Stupid thing. You're hopeless again. <laughs> Was he hopeless before? No. 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 
At the start of my turn, I have to roll a d10, one to three. All heroes get plus one stress. Yeah, that's great. So I'm not only hopeless, I'm telling everybody telling how hopeless everybody. it is. We're going to die. <laughs> it's over, man. It's over. It fits <laughs> how he's been treated. I'm done. It's over. It's over. Game over, man. Oh, game over. All right. Why don't you put her in charge? Wait a second, how did he get that? Oh, that's because we... Alright. Because we're taking she's stress... She's not like in it's... charge now, she's tired and nervous. Mm. And every time you give me stress, I'm going to take two stress. That's the other it is. stress. Alright. We're exploring the next room, the next dungeon. Hanging yeah. around with the Crusader too Look much. Look at that, there's another... Highwaymen. Oh, hungry. Oh. Crusader oh. is... Cheerios. Cheerios. Alright, starting with Cheerios. I have to do this. You this have to do this. Good. This is it. We gotta get through this last one. Alright, here we go. So I get a negative quirk. Yep. Oh, you get to replace your disease. Hey, I'm clumsy. I get to replace my disease. I'm no longer a hemophiliac. I am in UE. <laughs> sure. Which means. <laughs> Uh, resolve is tested. I get negative one virtue chance. Yeah. So I don't know what that means, but oh, actually, that's funny. Um, up here, I'm hungry, and there's no food to eat. Nope. So, so I just take four damage. Four damage. Okay. Um, oh wait, do we get ten bucks though? We do. Strong we get bucks, ten bucks, and I get a die. Oh, nice. Roll it, roll it. Maybe it was food. Shovel. Shovel. Guess what I'm going to do with that shovel? I'm going to smash this trap. Good for it. Good, good, good. All right. And then I get a curio as well. Another one. Display cabinet. I get a stress. I get another negative quirk. Another. I get, I'm now light sensitive and a warrior of light. <laughs> so when the light goes up, I take damage and I heal too. So, those kind of offset each other. Offset each other. We get 10 more bucks, we are getting rich, and we get another dice. I like Cheerios. Except for when they give us bandages. Shouldn't this be flipped over? Didn't we already? We are, no, we're not there yet. Or we just, oh yeah, we did. We uh, scouted it. Yeah. Oh. Okay. So, because we have so many bandages, I am going to use one to get rid of, oh, didn't we have some bleed? We did not have bleed. I've got that blight. Mm -hmm. Should I use that? I'm yes. Maybe. Yes, okay. get rid of it. Okay, so we're going to a combat room. Yep. So we'll flip one of these over. Yep. So three... Does this get shuffled every single time we, no. we draw from it? No. So three goes on the bottom. Yep. And we'll flip over eight. Invocation chamber. Right. We know this we one know well. Place. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, here we go. Let's see what we got. Cultist Acolyte. Where is that wonderful Acolyte? There she is. Acolyte is in the last place. A gargoyle. Oh boy. Super duper. It was super easy last time. <laughs> I don't A Bone rabble. You keep on using that word. <laughs> I do not think it means what you think it means. Oh, that was nice. A bone rabble. And ooh, a musketeer. One of the three musket. D'Artagnan. <laughs> He's still there. All right. He's ranged. My two mm. characters go here. It's not bad. Not bad, not bad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, One ten. One more level blue, two baddie. Uh, with armor and seven life. That but if we clear in. this room, we're good to go back to the Hamlet, wouldn't you we think? We are good to go back to the Hamlet, yes. Because that's two? Yep, I agree. We got two of those, two of these out. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess not two, but... One on one. Three's fingers aren't working again. 
I need to put sleeves on these little guys. Alright, starting with Crusader. Crusader. Run faster. Um, I can't. <laughs> this armor is heavy, man. Uh, so we're going to move one. And do zealous accusation. On that bone rebel. So... Oh, you got clumsy. Nice. <laughs> Whenever I do damage, I take a debuff. Yeah, that's real mm -hmm. nice. Yep. Okay, if I crit, I can kill this guy. But I, you know, we'll see. Um, okay. So we've got accuracy 9. So it didn't crit, but it does 5 damage. We do get the plus to the crit now. And I have a debuff. That's 5 to the bone rabble? Yes. Right on. Okay, anyway, man. Did he roll his one to three? He did not. Nice. That's a ten. He needs to roll his one to five. <laughs> nope. Nobody likes nothing around here. Alright, so he's gonna move up one. Two. And um, do a open vein on this guy. Okay. It's a uh, ten accuracy, so it's a hit. It's a hit. Four damage. Five. No oh, five damage. Either way, he's gone. So. Yep. Okay. Um, get rid of that, that. You're up. Right on. Gargoyle's up. Ten. And he wants to do a lash of the tail to the closest. So the closest would happen to be you. <laughs> I like being skipped over. Um, <laughs> no, it's, accuracy is nine, so seven, critical chance two. Right on. Okay, so that's three damage. That is a stun for, oh, you're stun resistant, so it's stun for one turn. And it's going to push you one space. Robber's turn. Yep, yep, yep. Gray Robber is, let's see, that guy's dead. He's coming up. I don't think he can get to there. That dude does have armor, though. So the Gray Robber is going to move two and throw a poison dart. One trick pony at this point. So accuracy is 11, minus two, so accuracy is nine, crit chance is two. That is a hit for three damage, half rounded up is two damage, and enough blight for days. Ruin his day, his week, and his year. <laughs> okay, it's your turn. All right, the Fusilier is going to... Do a blanket fire against the most crowded space mm -hmm. and two spaces away. So accuracy is seven, crit chance is one. So you have to remind, remove your dodge. So that's, that's a, a miss. miss. That's a beautiful miss. Ah! Acolyte. She's in the back. She would like to do an Eldritch Pole. Against the furthest away. So she's going to do an Eldritch Pull against him. She needs to be range two. Would it be against him since he's further back? And the line? Well, actually, she's not going to do an Eldritch Pull. Remember? She's going to go here to make sure she's standing in the middle. Ah, gotcha. 
So she's not even gonna do the pull. She's just gonna go there. And it's gonna cause us a whole bunch of. Yeah, so the Vestal's turn. Vestal's gonna get rid of her last debuff. Gonna move forward one and she'll heal. Grave Divine Robert. Comfort, the Grave Robber. So crit chance four. No. So two each. One, two. Okay. That's her turn. Hmm. So we all take two damage. I mean two, all take uh, two stress. stress. One, two, one, two. Stun for heroes means you only lose one of your one actions. One of your two actions, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, we do have two chests out there, so I know I'm greedy, but I'd like to get a hold of one of them suckers. Oh, money we, we got. got! I know, we need more! Oh, we don't! We can upgrade town. Upgrade the hamlet. We're supposed mm -hmm. to be bringing it back to its former glory, remember? Yeah, we gotta take care of the darkness. It's prevalent first. Nah. That's, that's just wishy-washy. <laughs> Alright, so five damage there. Mm -hmm. He'll bleed out on his next turn, either way. And he is going to do an eight. He's going to do a lash of the tail again against the closest, which is Grave Robber. So, mm -hmm. critical chance, seven. Or accuracy critical seven. Accuracy seven, critical chance two. Seven. Dang. So three damage. Stun for two turns and pushed. Look at that. To there. Right where you wanted to go. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> and don't look at the gift horse in the mouth now. <laughs> Alright. Oh hard. no! Yep. Oh, he wants man, to do, guys get to go first. He wants to do blanket fire again against you. Mm -hmm. Accuracy is seven, crit chance one. You're lucky. That was cocked. For sure. 100%. All right. No, it's always 100%. <laughs> 10. All right. That's a nothing. That's another miss. That dude just like pepper in the walls. <laughs> he is. <laughs> We're standing behind these two 2 by 4s over here. Crusader's up. All right. Crusader is going to come up here and do zealous accusation over there. Because that will kill the gargoyle. Mm -hmm. So that is a hit. Five. How much damage? Uh, five damage on each of them. Okay. I'm going on this out. And we might be able to take out the acolyte this turn, so we don't have any more stress. Mm-hmm. Okay. Highwayman's <laughs> up. Highwayman. You know what? I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it. Two. Oh, go ahead. I do, but what's his? He needs four more damage. Mm -hmm. Range two. Yeah, I have a pistol shot. Yeah, so that he he doesn't keep doing that nastiness. So we'll do pistol pistol shot over here. Accuracy of nine. Crit one. Uh, two. one, two, three. Uh, it doesn't matter because it's five damage. Against her? Yes. So now you can plunder to your heart's content. Sweet. While we take care of business over here. Alright, so it's her turn. I think I'm going to check this. Wait. No. Copy. Did I roll for him? Nope. Nope. You almost got it there. Okay. Well, I got us a piece of loot, which is not very helpful right now. Um, Just another bandage? Sure. 
that takes away some wounds we don't have to heal and yep. kill them. Yep. Okay. All right. So that was her first action. Second action. Just to get within range. All right. Then her turn. She's gonna step one and heal. Her this time she's gonna heal her for oh she has no second action. Oh yeah that's true. Yep. So she still can get healed though. Yeah. I'm gonna heal her with the big one, the divine grace. Cool. Oh, still good. Still good for five. Okay, that's our turn. Mm-hmm. One, two, three, four, five. All right, now you can finish him. No, yeah. Still gotta go. Wait, he has eight. He hasn't been touched yet. Yep. Okay, so we gotta see if he goes first. He's just been shooting. Because if he goes first, he's gonna just move here. Yes, correct. And he goes first. So he just moves. Yep. Uh, right down the line. All right. So Crusader. Um, what is that? Eight damage. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm. Well, uh, zeal zealous accusation. That's your biggest hitter? Or you can heal, I guess. I don't have anything that... You can heal him in a range of one, right? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I could do that. So I'm going to do zealous gotcha. accusation. Yeah, yeah. Zealous accusation first. That's a hit. So five, five damage on him. And then I'll do battle heal on nice. the high wingman. And that is a critical... So it's five. He heals five. Learn from the best, Vestal. Okay, and you get uh, one stress back. Uh, learn from the best, yeah. Vestal. She ignored that completely. No, I was saying I learned from the best. Oh, I was I a, that was a compliment, man. I'm trying to talk about it. All right. She's um, too busy that's listening that. to you yell at everybody. And so... He's gonna go one, two, and try to end the story here with an open vein. Eight. So that's accuracy ten. Yep. Minus one nine, so it's a hit. Fire right. damage. So he's out. We finished our room. Now we can go back to town. Mm hmm. Which we're going to go back to town, but we have five bandages first, and we still have our campfire for eight. Oh, ooh, we're going to camp before we go back to town. Why not? So you guys could heal up, like, all five of yours. One, with two, the bandages. three, four, five. Yep. And we might as well. I don't know what we're going to do in town exactly, but... I say we build we it could, up. We could actually, yeah. A little bit. Yeah, yeah. Like we, we, have so eight. we have eight, so we either drop, well, I can do my thing, although she'll get a debuff, so it'll drop us each by one, um, so we can kind of, um, like if we do two and two, that'll leave you with four. four. So I'll just do one, two, I'm just wondering, three. what is our, do we get six for a full? Four. Huh? Okay. Then I'll have to figure out how to get these two down. He did four and I did two each. Which is as long as we can get them to that place to heal up. Right. It'll be fine. Yeah. Okay. I'm good with that. Okay. All right. So we are headed back to town. Yep. See you in a little bit. Right on. Okay, here we are back at the hamlet. That was a rough go through the second. Second one was way better than dungeon. the first one. True. Way better. But still, we got lucky with the curios. We got lucky with those two curios rooms being together. Yes. We were able to get out with two experience points each, so we're, we're doing pretty good that way. But we, do have a lot we of still have guys. to go and, and fight that stupid heretic. Yes. So we got to gear up for that now. Here we go. First Hamlet things event. first, Hamlet event. 
guild training. The guildmaster, once a benevolent adventurer who has witnessed the death of all of his prodigies, his tutelage, his tutelage and honorary tribute uh, to them and to himself. Each hero can immediately upgrade a skill for free. At the end of this hammer phase, remove this event from the deck. So we get two days. Once. We get two days. Everybody um, gets a free upgrade. Everybody gets a free upgrade of one of their skills. Wow. Wow. Right. Now. Um, so, let's take a look here. Well, let me roll up and Dex take a look here. Roll. Whoa. <laughs> You're killing me. <laughs> Should I go? I use it enough. Should I go up to Zealous Accusation 2? Yes. It gives me crit 11, accurate, I mean, regular 6. Yes, you should. Yeah, I'm going to do it. So, there we go. Zealous Accusation 2 in the house. Five, actually. All right. And for the Highwaymen. Let's see here. Judgment. Ooh. I wanted some of these guys when I was upgrading, so. Uh, open vein two. Whew. I'm liking it. I'm gonna upgrade Divine Comfort two. Just for. Oh, that's not much more healing. It's three, three. Yeah, that's right. I'm supposed to be a healer, so I'll do it. <laughs> supposed to be a healer, I'll do it. Okay, so I got my thrown daggers. Go with my poison darts now. And what have... should I do here? Um, pistol shot two. This guy's going I'm to. I'm thinking open vein two. Oof. I'm thinking open vein two. It gives me. Yeah. Gives you two bleeds for three turns with a base damage of seven instead of five. Yeah. So that's where I'm going there. All right, I'm all good okay, to so go. I'm going to turn this one in. Okay. For a positive quirk. Positive quirk. Okay, flip your thing back over. I am evasive. Oh, jeez. Every time you evade, you. Uh... I get minus one stress. Nice. That's cool. And this flips over to And he's going to turn his in for a negative quirk. This goes away too? Mm-hmm. This... Oh, he just gets one more. Not get, you can keep that. You're clumsy. I don't want it. I'm, I'm nocturnal again. <laughs> yeah. Right. I came back. The doctor said I was cured. This torch is not good. <laughs> and then your thing turns back over. Yeah. So, All right, so we have two I'm days. Looking, I'm looking not bad on stress right Unfortunately, now. Unfortunately, he covered up the quirk removal. Dun, dun, dun. So, I don't know. We should. Look at how much money we got. Wow. We are We need to upgrade Sanitarium. Or you want to upgrade tavern. tavern. You want to grab Tavern and Sanitarium? I don't remember which how much they got on them. Let's see here. Tavern 2. Uh, allows us to get rid of three for one, six for three, or nine for nine. Nine for nine. Um, okay, but we don't need it right now. And then... I do need the six. Sanitarium. Sanitarium, Sanitarium allows you to heal seven for one, 14 for three, or remove disease for two. We don't need that either. What about the guilt? The guilt? Hmm... Blacksmith, too. Use one of your skills at level three for one quest. Hmm. Where is the guild? Stage coach. It's on the very bottom, isn't it? No. Maybe the guild does not have an upgrade. A survivalist. Yep. Huh. Right that's on. that's kind of weird. That's kind of weird. All right. Well, we have two. We can actually Sanitarium, upgrade the Abbey, Tavern even though he's got Stagecoach, Blacksmith, Stagecoach. Yeah, so I guess Stagecoach 2, Blacksmith, um, where is it? Blacksmith 2, Blacksmith 3, 
Nomad Wagon 2, um, Nomad Wagon 3, Survivalist 3, because we already have Survivalist 2 out there. So yeah, you can't upgrade, apparently, the guild. Okay. I would imagine maybe because of that event card that we just had. So maybe. probably we should upgrade know. the sanitarium. At least it won't help us this time, but we did have some big health issues last time. We can't upgrade the... We can. We can? Yeah, he just has it blocked. It does give us a possible positive quirk. But that could be gone next turn, yeah? He, he could help move, yeah. Yeah, so I say we do the... Because the quirks are where we're really going to yeah, hurt. we're going to need to remove... Yep. So we'll do that. Okay. So we're going to upgrade the Abbey 2 for 20. All right. So anyways, in the meantime, I'm going to go out of order. <laughs> and I'm going to put her here you. to spend three bucks. Two heal, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So stress oh, relief. are supposed to go back in there. Yeah. I took some stress relief. Okay. Um, I don't need any healing. Might as well do so. Hmm. Maybe do some more um, upgrading. Good. Uh, I think I'll send. Uh, got the most He's crusader. I got one level two. over. Okay. And then uh, we'll upgrade a skill card for two gold and two experience. So I need a three. Three or four? Three. Uh, yeah, just give me three. Oh, gotcha. So. Two bucks. I'm going to upgrade. Does my other guy need to do something too? Oh, you just go ahead and go. You can? You go ahead. Um. I don't really... How's everybody's stress? Everybody's stress is pretty good. Yeah. For right now. Yeah. Um, I can... Well, I'm still going to do... Well, for now, I'll do this one next. So I'm going to go here, spend three bucks. To get two extra provision dice. Okay, so I'm either doing Stunning Blow or Smite. So do we want the plus two versus Unholy? Or do we want uh, Stun for two turns instead of just one? Hmm. Uh, accuracy. Oh, the damage is different. Damage is five or nine. Hmm. I take the big hits. Yeah. I know that's greedy, but uh, I don't disagree. There we go. All right. So he's done. So now we got to do the highwayman. Uh huh. Oh, um, you can remove his disease. Yeah, I think yeah, I'm going to yeah. do that. Two bucks. That's a good idea. Okay. One day down. Okay. Quick and dirty. Second day he goes to here. We cannot... Oh, she cannot heal her stress. That's not great. Oh, that sucks. But I would like to remove my lethargy. If that's okay. The disease? Yeah, I don't need it. I don't need it. Because this isn't really hurting me that much. So. Especially when I forget to use it. Okay. <laughs> to our benefit, not to yeah. detriment. I think I'm going to go with. Uh, uh, I'm going to send him here to remove two corks. Nice. For five bucks. Yeah. So all these are gone for sure. And the highwayman, I think I'll... Do you want to go to the guild? Um, with no, days? go ahead. So I'll go here and spend two experience points and two bucks to upgrade one of those skills. Okay, so then I think the Vestal, especially now that she can't get any stress relief... Um, only three stress relief and you know? well it's a buff for everybody though too let's do it I'm gonna go here I'm gonna take good four turn debuff wait I could I could do her top one. Oh, that'd be crazy never mind I don't want to do that 
everybody gets one stress relief. So, just just one each. One each? Yep. Okay. We each also get a buff for three turns. Oh, that should have gone away. That should have gone away. Just give me two more buff. Buff for four because of the boss. And that is. That should be everybody. Okay. I think I'll do pistol shot two. I get over there. That wasn't hers, right? You can rearrange these, right? Every right. time we go back. Yep. Anytime so. we go back, yeah. And your twos always stay level two, so. Right. So even if you took your twos off the board and used your ones, you could still go back to those same twos later. Okay. Um, I'm gonna use, uh, see, that's weird. I've got this thing against uh, marked people, but I don't have anything that gives people marks, so it doesn't Yeah, so there's a lot of synergies anything. with like the... Other characters? Other characters. Well, they'll mark them and then you can blow them away type of thing. Right. So, I think the bounty hunter marks them. There's several that mark. I think the gesture marks. Uh, I just don't use I just don't use Duelist Advance very much, so yeah. I'm going to use... Uh, takes away some of his range, but... I'm going to use Wicked Slice instead. Duelist Advance just wasn't working that great. Disrupted right. him too much. So we're done. We still got $22. 22 gold for next time. Good start. Good start. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get all those freaking marks later. Mm -hmm. Alright, so you can take that away. You don't. Here we go. We are headed in to go punch the fanatic in the nose. Right smack dab in the face. And uh, he is in one of these outer... He's either here, here, or here. Oh, he could be here, couldn't he? Nope. No, because it's so connected, connected here. Twice. So one, two, or three. He's in one of those rooms. We got to go try to find him and punch him in the face because he's just not a nice guy. Yep. At all. So At all. we're going to try to take care of him. Um, he's a nasty little mamma jamma, though. So here we go. We're going to roll our dice. Big Let's see dice. how it goes. Food. Right, got lots of food. Bandages and a DD. So, uh, wow. So, ouch. Um, you need torches, at least a torch and another shovel, or two torches, or. Uh, I'll do a torch. You. Do a shovel or a torch? And those, you know, a lot of damage. Whatever you choose, traps. we're gonna need the opposite one. Oh, I can attack with, light the place up all day long. I suppose. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Hopefully. Mm -hmm. Fingers crossed. Mm -hmm. All right. So, Happy Go Lucky here is gonna uh, raise a stress as she scouts. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy is right. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. We're gonna scout the first one. It is a nice little combat room. Hmm. On our way. Okay, Exploration. Highwaymen. Oh, curio. Good old traps. Crusader. And hmm. another trap. <laughs> so we got three traps. We only took two shovels. And a curio. Um, well, let me. You still Problem. have. So every time I get one, I get, I'm nervous. So I'll take a dump. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is not good. All right. The Crusader will uh, just roll against the trap. All right. So that's nice. a critical. Six points of damage. <laughs> Nothing like starting out with a bang. Yeah. Um, so six points of damage. And um, the Highwaymen will uh, do the same. Oof. Okay. So. No, I have the highwayman use that and let her do the same. 
She heals herself every time she heals That's people. true. Okay. Um, you use one of these. All right, we'll do. Talked you into it. You did. All right, so should I use the, our only torch or just take this negative curio, which is going to have more stress for her? Um, we might need the torch. I'll take the curio. Without the uh, torch. Um. <laughs> All right, I'll watch this. Just, just do the torch. All right, hand me that curio over there. I hope that it's amazing. Did we shuffle these? We did. A Ten bucks, urn. and you get a torch uh, bag, possibly. That would have been too bad, just a little bit of bleed and stuff. Mm -hmm. All right, ten bucks. Our other money's over there in town. Yep. And we get a dice. Torch, 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 torch. <laughs> right on. Perfect. The rest of this is going to go straight downhill. Okay. So then, for her, she's going to go ahead and roll the attack against her. Come on. Ten. Ten. Five. Ah. So that's four damage. Four damage. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Okay. All right. Well, we got to our combat room. We're gonna. These were shuffled. Yes. I don't know if they were shuffled well, but they were shuffled. Well, we haven't seen that one today. The ritual chamber. Uh, corner heroes ending their turn in the corners suffer one stress. There's only two of those in the in, on the on the room. Yeah, there we go. So if we end our turn here or okay. up there, where we start basically. So no turtling. Got it. All right, here we go. These are not Would you trouble. get up? Stop crawling around. What's wrong with you? I'm turtling. <laughs> <laughs> I don't follow rules very well. Any? Oh, we start. Oh, you know, look at that. They're trying to sweeten the pot a little bit. Uh -huh. So that we don't finish the combat. Is, no, they put they put treasure oh, chests make you stay there. in there. Uh -huh. Well, I cannot stay there. Not with my yeah, no, super I can't stress either. relief. Or unrelief. Okay. We have another bone cord here. Just say nay. These guys just keep on coming. Bone cordier. Right. He comes up last. Arbalest is. Yep. Where is he gonna go? He's gonna go over here. He's just walking around, drinking. Another arbalist. Sipping on gin. Hey, look, juice. It's our Pliskin. We missed the Pliskin. Oh. Yeah, the Pliskin, I you know, I, I was Harsh about him last last time. After after meeting his friend the rattler, yep. I'm um. So the rule I believe is that if we draw a large creature, we have to take one out of a space so that he will fit. Okay, so what just came out? The arbalist. Yeah, the arbalist is out. The bone captain is in. Bone Captain is ready. That's your one. Oh dear. <laughs> Level 33. That dude. 33, 33 health? health? Man, that dude did not come to play. Mini boss. Mini boss, my rear end. See the size of this dude? He's huge. Alright, where does he go? He huge. goes in a defensive spot. Look at that. Oh, he comes up here. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Oh no. Alright. The bone captain is definitely ready. Now at the beginning of our turn, each of us would take three marks, but let's make sure no damage to marks. So we don't need okay, them. We don't need the marks. Alright. Okay, do Dude, this is not cool. This is no bueno. We got this. All he I'm does close is that door. Mm -hmm. All he does is smash people in groups. Go ahead. So we need to spread out. Flip that over. Huh? We just need to spread out. All right, here we go. Initiative. Whoosh. The Crusader. Hmm. Old captain is dead. That has a ground pound that hits a whole, the most crowded room and does two stun. That of course, this normal cool. swing does 11 damage, so... My normal swing does 11 damage against Unholy, so... Nice. 
in your face, ugly man. Go punch him twice. I am. I'm gonna. Well, I'm gonna come Seven. in here and punch him once. Okay. I'm gonna move one, and I'm gonna use smite two, accuracy ten. So accuracy one nine, punch. crit one. Yes. Ooh. So I hit him. Yep. And it does nine damage plus two. Plus versus two. Versus unholy. Wow. So that's 11 damage. 11 damage. One third of his health. Okay. Just that's stay turn. still. Okay. I'll stay over here. <laughs> no. You do I was you talking to him. him. No. I thought you were talking to me. <laughs> All right. Highwayman's up. Highwayman. Uh, he's got that snake over there. And he has two spaces One, from the two. big guy. He is. So, I will do a pistol shot. Crit two, accuracy nine. Nice. Got him. That's just seven damage. Okay. And then I'm going to move one. Right here. So I don't you don't have another range too, huh? I do not. That's a bummer. Yeah, Copy. Okay. So also, you're move. not in the darkness. Well, I can move two, though. I wonder if that would matter. This gives me plus one to range, right? It does. So I'll go there. Okay. All right. The Pliskin's turn. He is in the attack, so he's going to do an infuse. Oh, we love the infuse <laughs> against the closest, which would actually be her. So he yep. has two movement. He's going to move in with her. He's going to attack with an accuracy of 10, critical chance of 1, so accuracy of 8. Yeah, she doesn't have a debuff, so. All right, crit chance 1, accuracy 8. Hey, that's a miss. That is a miss, Nikki. We'll take it. Right. Okay. It is his turn. The Bone Captain says he would like to... He'd like to do a ground pound in the most crowded space, which is where he's standing. He is accuracy 9... Minus one. And one for the torch, so accuracy seven, crit chance one. Um, I'll do crit accuracy six. Accuracy six. Nice. Ooh didn't need it, but okay. Right, didn't need it. But you would have needed it if you didn't roll. All right. <laughs> okay. And the bone court here. In the last place, he wants to do a tempting goblet against the most stress, which would be the Vestal this time. Mm. So he wants range um, two, which is right where he's standing. Mm -hmm. so accuracy is ten, accuracy is eight, crit chance zero. Ooh. <laughs> crit chance zero. Okay, that's good. <laughs> lucky, lucky. All right, who's got the ducky? I did three damage. <laughs> what, what is that? Where did that come from? <laughs> lucky, lucky, who's got the ducky? Yep. Is that a thing now? <laughs> it might be. <laughs> and one stress. I'll take it. All right. So that means Grave Robber's up. And the Grave Robber's going to take two stress if she stays there. Right. Because of her nervousness. So, she... What's my pick to the face? Not enough. She's gonna move. No. Okay. Yeah, she can move through. She can she move just through. Can't stay. Yep. She's gonna move there. Then she's going to. Neither one of those are blighted, right? Mm. -mm. She will poison dart the big guy, or is that a waste? Or she should just go for damage. Um. Well, I guess it's the same damage either way. So, crit chance, 1, accuracy, 11. Crit chance. Accuracy, crit chance, 2, thank you. Accuracy, 10. Right. 
Well, that's a hit. For three damage. And three blight for three turns. Nice. You're gonna die one way or another. Yeah, you is. Okay. And the Vestal, oh yeah, the Vestal would go next anyway, sorry. And the Vestal's up next. She does not want any stress either. So <clears throat> she's gonna step forward, how's her health? I think her health's Other fine, why don't you... She's eight. Why don't you just take this, well, and then move out? Oh, I could. I think I could heal her. Or I could even do... Uh, oh, you're hurting though, yeah. Yeah, I'm hurting. Or I could do a dazzling light and try to stun one of them. He can't be stunned. The courtier could be stunned. But she's hurting. She's eight down. She never likes to heal herself, though. Oh. Should I take that? I'm going to take it. I'll do it. That's one of our choice. What is it? Torch? Yeah. Okay, we'll take a torch. Cool beans. And then, I think to stay safe, she's actually going to walk this way. Okay. To that is that. Round two. Fight. Round two. Everybody's still on board. I don't need that anymore. So he's at 21. He's at 21 right now, yeah. And he's going to take three yeah. on his turn. So that's nine, nine. Nine damage. What you have, I can do can that. I can do that. That's nice. That's a big attack. Okay, here we go. Crusader's up first. All right. First, first roll. Uh, so... Accuracy Smite. nine. Accuracy nine. Crit uh, zero. Crit one. One. Nice. That's a hit. Eleven more. Okay. Eleven more, and that puts him at thirty-two. He will die on his turn. Or I can just kill him right now. Or you can smack that dude. I could. As a matter of fact, I will. Stunning blow. See, you're not worthless after all, Crusader. <laughs> Accuracy <laughs> eight. Crit one. Da. Uh, maybe not. Da. Okay. All right. Highwayman's next. Highwayman. He is here. So. Um. One two. One two three. Because I get plus one for being up here. Yeah, but he can't shoot around corners, so can't shoot around. Oh, that's right. Have, He's got to have. You have to have a line into the room of <laughs> some sort. Yep. Well, I do have a line into the room. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> throw the boomerang. <laughs> All right, so we'll we'll uh, shoot at the courtier, and that's going to be a pistol shot. Accuracy ten, accuracy nine, crit one two. That's a hit. That's seven damage. He's dead. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Seven. Perfect. Oh. Okay. That was your first action? Uh, that was my first action. Um... I think that moving right now is a good idea. Getting one closer to Pluskin might be but okay, but yeah, I mean. But see, here's the thing, I've, I've got range on him right now. Yeah, but you can't shoot around the corner, it's a problem. Oh, that's true. So if you got up there. So one, two. And you down a straight line of sight. Yeah. All right, so Pluskin's first. He wants to do an infuse against the closest. Um, accuracy 8, critical chance 1. Alright, so that's 4 damage, and 
two blight for three turns. Okay. <coughs> Big guy's gonna go away. <laughs> finish, finish your statement, big guy. Yeah, that's, mm -hmm. that's pretty awesome. He's pretty nasty. Okay, so that leaves Grave Robber. Grave Robber's gonna go ahead and throw Poison Dart. He's not, he's resistant, but not immune. Okay, so Poison Dart, accuracy 11. So accuracy 10, crit chance of 1, 2. Alright, so that's a hit. Why don't you stop? She's not going to stand up. I'm trying to get her to stand up. She's not going to stand up. Alright, so that's 3 damage. 1, 2, 3. And... 2... 3 blades. for 2 rounds. Yeah. Okay. Now the advantage there is now I throw the dagger at her, I get plus two damage against something that's blighted. Sweet. So. Oh, with a, a crit. crit. So that'll do their one, and I will get one. one. Iwoman will get one, and that would be 12 damage. Deed. 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 Okay. Sweet. We are awesome. We got this. That's right. Oh my goodness. <laughs> We're going to psych ourselves out. All right, to the fiery doom. Okay. All right, so that room's cleared. Yes. All right, so now we can scout this poor old... So that costs one here and two for there. And we get a look at the three rooms. Mm -hmm. Treasure room, curio, and darkness. So the, oh, it's just that if we go, we got to check this one, right, before we leave? Yeah, I think so. Okay. We go too far away. It would be murder to get back to it. Murder to get back. So we're going here? Yep. The gold room? All right. I have it, man. Oh, man. I've never seen so many traps. Sweet! Alright, you got a curio. <clears throat> yep. We got two torches. Um, yeah, I think we used one of the torches. I agree. So. And then I think we also uh, should so use one of these blights, one of these antidotes, and get rid of your six stack sure. of blight. Yeah. Alright, here's my curio that I only get the positive stuff from. Mm -hmm. So we get five bucks. Ooh. That's a lot of negative. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Plus one stress. Uh, one three blight. Uh, no, one blight. One blight for three turns, and then two debuffs. A debuff for two turns. I'm not wow. horrible. It's better than disease, I guess. Wow. Okay. Over here, we got two shovels left. Left. I think. I don't what know where. I got it. Use both. Well, I'm thinking we might just take some damage and. Let me take some damage. We have you already some have healing. some. Yeah, I know, but so how much is this? This is four. No, it's two damage, two stress. I got That's not this. Not too bad. I got you, fam. Yeah. Well, I'm actually gonna roll this. Yeah. We got a long ways to go. I want to save those for when we're somebody's hurt. And... Right. That's a That's miss. That's a miss. Yeah. She got nothing. All right. So now we are in the gold room. We are. So what have we got? Want to take a guess? No, seven. Okay. Two. Oh, that was close. Torture chamber. Unholy aura. Heroes in this area can't heal or be healed. In the torture chamber? Like a soul. I don't think I want to heal there anyways. Like you're going you know, we to... We're start, just hanging out there healing. We start there. That's not good. No healing or being healed from here. Right. Okay. We're all checking out the torture rack over here. What's up? The Acolyte. Oh, boy. You know what? what this is, is actually kind of a really nasty room. Acolyte starts here. Oh, look. 
pulled another freaking blood letter. Did I actually put him at the bottom? Tell me I did. Oh, that wasn't the blood letter. That was the captain. He was in the last dungeon, wasn't he? Yes. So he got shuffled back in. Okay. Well, there's a lot of treasures in here. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, nice. There's three. Okay. I think that's it, though. So we got a blood letter. And we got a bone rabble. Yes, he's ready. <laughs> <laughs> See, now you're just saying it. You're just answering. Where's that little dude with the club go? Come on now. Do I have him over here? What little dude with the club? Yeah. Oh, oh, the Bone Rebel guy. Bone Rebel. Oh. oh, here's the cute one. Oh, look at him. <laughs> He's so sad. He said, I don't want to be part of this army. Very sad. And this guy? Yes. I was just thinking, because only four people can go in here, and there's already... What's the... Oh, I see. I see. He's both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Here we go. They can't hit me because I'm crawling. That's the thing. See? <laughs> <laughs> I'm out there. Uh... He's he's about to show you how he can hit you. Uh, oh, man. Because he's going he's gonna... to... The whole room. Can you imagine? Uh, he's going to. Uh, isn't he? He can, but he's he's going to. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, he is doing the rain of whips on the whole room. Ow! All right, accuracy is nine, good chance is zero. So Want me to go roll ahead, it? roll it. Come on, ten. Okay. Or a two. Everybody takes one damage. Oh, really? That's nothing. That's not yet. <laughs> All right, everybody takes one bleed for three turns. Oof. I don't even know if we have any. So that's two for him, two for the Vestal. Oh, because they are Three, resistant to it, right? they're resistant. Two, uh, one. <laughs> and oh. everybody takes a stress. So I'll yeah, take that, two. I'd say that would be stressful. Here's three. For, what, is one of your people a resistant? Two. Yeah, I need a two. Okay, he just cat and nine tails. That is all. something else. If that's not thematic, we're in the torture chamber. Yes, and he's, he's right smacking us with a cat and nine tails. Yep. That's right. Okay, the Man. bone rabble wants to get involved. So he would like to bump in the night against. He the doesn't team. look like he wants to be involved. <laughs> he, he does, though. He's, he's unhappy. Okay. He's going to walk to here, and that's all he's going to do, actually. Okay. And, oh, look, the Acolyte wants to get involved, too. Oh, my God, <laughs> She would like to do a stressful incantation against the most stressed. Oh, and that's And you wonder bad. who that is. All well, right. she has been working very hard keeping us alive. Well, so it's anymore. only She's natural. going to become selfish. That's my, that's my guess. She's going to become <laughs> selfish. <laughs> All right, accuracy nine, so accuracy eight, accuracy seven, crit chance zero. Seven. There it is, one damage. Oh, that She's hurting. That's, yep, yeah, 10 over 17. She's gonna gain a stress, okay, which is gonna put her over here, which means I'm gonna roll this for a resolve test, which we should have done earlier, but if I get a one or a two, I get a virtue. Otherwise, what did I say I'm gonna get? You said you were going to get, um, what was it? Uh, selfish, the selfish. one that the Crusader uh, let's had. Let's do it. Nope, hopeless. That's. I also had that one. That so. might make it worse. Yeah, you had that one as well. All right, she's now hopeless, and the torch is going to go down one. Okay. She's to put her so now we just go down the track. Yep, go down the track. Crusader is up. So here's the thing, if I move there, everybody gets stuck. Mm -hmm. And nobody can heal there. And nobody can heal there. But you can't move through because you already used I your I can't speed. move through. We can all move through. Yes. Well, kind of. 
So I will be... I still can't move through. I can't use my healing. No, wait, you can move through. Yeah, but... Yes, she can't but move through But the Vestal can't. But she can move through. No, she can't, can she? Because she has to use... Is that how the rule goes, that you have to use... If you can use... No, like if she uses one movement to go here, she can use her second movement to get out. And that's as legal. As long as you can okay. get past. As long as you can get through. Okay. Yep. Well, then that kind of... Yep, yep. I I mean, I think that's what I should do. I think I should uh, I think so. maybe zealously... No. Actually, All these guys are unholy, aren't they? Uh, oh, the brigand no. doesn't. Um, actually, she's human, too. So they're two humans. So the bone rabble's unholy. But if you zealously excused, you'd get a piece of all three of them. I would. Well, no, two. Oh, two enemies in the Jason. Yeah. Okay, I was thinking it was all. No, my grape shot. Mm. Oh, they're going to get two. Don't worry. <clears throat> um. Ah. So really, what's the big hitter, then? Go out the big hitter is smite, too. I can go out there and, and uh, smack the brig and blood letter for... Uh, well, I can take out the bone rabble outright. Either way... You I actually, I could, I could take out the bone rabble with my zealous accusation and do six damage to the other... Nah, I, I've, I've got to do that one. It, do, it doesn't hurt us, we just can't be healed right. here. So, I'm good. I'll stay here. Um... Zealously accuse. Zealously accuse. Accuracy 10. You have wrongly imprisoned Six. us, sir. Six. That hits everybody. That hits everybody. For how much? So, it's six damage, which kills this dude. Okay. And uh, let's put the other six. Do you want to do it on the brigand, or do you want to do it yeah, on the cultist? Yeah, do it on him. You have grape shot blast, if nothing else. Yeah. But, okay. Oh, actually, if you did it on her, then you grape shot blast. You'd finish her off, and then we could just focus fire. Let's that do guy. that. Let's do that. So three. I'm sorry, six on the on the acolyte. Yeah. Okay. And that also clears up space in here. Right. So second action, I can move out. Mm -hmm. That'll be still leave room. Okay. All right, so Highwayman's turn. Highwayman will do grape, grape shot. You're going to bleed one. Oh, He's going to bleed I should have, one. I should have done that already. Yep. So. Same with the Highwayman. Highwayman will bleed one and get plus one. Okay. Pew. Um... Okay, so the high women's first thing is going to be grape shot blast, accuracy eight, seven. It's a four. Okay. And so that does three damage to the acolyte and to the blood letter. But a scratch. And then. We'll do a uh, pistol shot. She's gone. Oh, oh. And then we'll do pistol shot on the blood letter. It's accuracy Oof. 10. So no dodge. No He's dodge. He's hard target to miss. So How much? Seven damage. There we go. Okay, so the grave robber's turn. She's gonna bleed for one. Oop. And hmm. are we gonna leave this guy alive, or you want me to just take him out? Take him out, All man. Right. We got to go find that f that heretic. All right, I'll do the poison He's the dart. I don't know if problem. I can take him out, but we'll see. I'll do the poison dart. Accuracy's 11, crit chance 2. <laughs> Good heavens. Got him. Barely. 1, 2, 3. 13 damage. 3 of these. 
Oh, yeah, never mind. Oops. And then I'm gonna throw a dagger at him. Um, accuracy is 10, critical chance 3. Got it. That's a crit. So she'll heal 1, he will heal 1. And that is so 10. She... Oh, no, she won't. Oh, got it. <laughs> that's 12 damage. 12 damage? Yeah, that's it. Got him. Done. Get out of our faces. Puny bad guys. Bye bye, chests. Oh well. We're not here for the chests. We are not. We're here for some healing. We need world. some healing. That'd be nice. Okay, that room's done and we get 20 gold. Add to our stash. Nice. That's for the Hamlet. Yeah. Hey, uh, and now we can scout. Scout. Okay, what is it? Purple, 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 purple. Not purple. Not purple. We don't want to go there. Nope. What is it? A trap? Oh, yeah, we definitely don't want to go there. Definitely. So one stress for going backtracking. Yep, that makes two for her. She's gonna die of stress, you know, so we know. Hmm? She's gonna die. What was this? I don't know. Did I flick one over? I don't know. It wasn't a torture, a shovel. I must have knocked it. Well, uh, uh, it was either bandage. It was a bandage, wasn't it? I think so. Get away. Okay. Be careful. I'm sorry. <laughs> so now we're, we're gonna go. Curios. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So we gotta. We are exploring. I win. Then. Yes! Please. Oh, please. No. Stressful darkness. Alright, so how's he doing on stress? Can he take two stress? Man, we've been up this high on red before. <laughs> yeah, we can take two stress. Okay. What are you talking about? Alright. So, then he's got nothing. He's got nothing. He's got a trap, which I think this time I'm going to use a shovel. And she's got food. Okay. Good to go. Good to go. So now we're up here. Alright, one to five, there's a combat. There is a combat. There's a combat. Alright, let's do it. There. I got that. We've got to get some healing in this turn. Somehow, some way. We can go to the this is not good for you. This is not good for me? Uh -oh. The invocation chamber. Oh my gosh. The friendly neighborhood. We are going to be losing the grave chamber. robber here. <laughs> the grave robber is going to die. <laughs> She's going to have a heart attack. She'll be fine. She's going to have a heart attack. Just saying. Just breathe. I think. No. No. Ugh. <sighs> Okay. Oh, we all know where we start. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jiminy Christmas. All right, Bone Rabble is in the front. Bone Rabble. Now you're making me do it. I know. <laughs> Come on, put the sad guy out here. He dies I faster. Know. Where is the sad guy? I need that dude. <laughs> I'll find the sad guy. Who's next? Bone Fusilier. Brigand, if you use the lead. Brigand, sorry, not bone. A gargoyle. We no. like gargoyles. Actually, yeah, gargoyle wasn't isn't that bad. Where is that little dude at? I don't know. He hides it every time I throw That's him. That's because he's sad. He doesn't want to fight. Are you sure? Here's his brother. Gargoyle. Yeah, he's he's a little angry. Oh, yeah, he's angry. It's like stop making fun of my brother. <laughs> And another bone corpse. Where's the gargoyle go defense? Oh, Way over here. Alright. Well, could be better. Could be worse. We got this. We got this. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We got them. We're back at round one. Thank goodness. Alright, we need to get some healing done. That's all you, Across bro. The board. No, it's you. Remember, you were teaching me how to do it earlier. No, 
Ooh, I was thanking you for teaching me. All right, Crusader's up. All right, Crusader is going to smack the zealous accusation. First, he's going to bleed. Oh, yes, he is going to bleed. Ain't got time to bleed. Oh, I got it. All right, here we go. So he's going to move one. And zealously accuse that gargoyle of being a Made out of wood? stinky stone. Your mother was made out that of wood. Would have been a crit would have been the last a crit. turn. Yes, it would have. But this turn it is not, so it is just six damage Four, on the gargoyle. Three. Yeah. Three damage. Okay. That's it. Here we go. Bone Ravel. Angry Bone Ravel. Yeah. He's going to do a bump in the night against the closest. So he's going to move one. Oh, he only has one movement. That's it. So he can't hit. He cannot hit. He's shuffling towards you. The highwayman. <laughs> I'm coming. Don't move. The highwayman is going to... He's going to do his pistol shot. Smack that gargoyle. He can bleed. Um, oh, that remind me of the labyrinth. Smack that. You know what? If I if I move two and hit with a wicked slice, he's dead. Your pistol shot's a seven two. Oh, that's true. Yeah, he's dead either way, as long as you don't miss. Wow. <laughs> Huh. Accuracy eight. Pistol shot two. Good chance two. There it is. Got it. So gargoyle there we go. Gonzo. We like the gargoyle. And I'll so move bad. up you ain't two. So tough. I'll move up two. Okay. It's his low hit points. <clears throat> he looks a lot nastier than he actually is because yeah. he's got only seven hit points. Well, he has a pretty good attack in there. If I'm yeah, he correctly. does. He's got a couple really good attacks. All right. Bone Corcher's going to go next. And he's in defense position. He is going to do a knife in the dark against the closest. Yep. Move up. Accuracy 7. So accuracy 5. That was a miss, miss, miss. miss. Okay. And the Fusilier is going to do a blanket fire against the most crowded spot from range two so um, accuracy is seven this is no bueno what are you talking about that's what i'm talking about <laughs> talk about that crit ouch ouch that's four damage each ouch they got crit again, so they're going to take stress. So her stress is going to be tested. Resolve test, a one or a two. There it is. Look at that. We Even find out today thing. that the grave robber is virtuous. <laughs> I don't know how that works out, but she is focused. Ooh. Okay. And stress here. Four damage here. Three, four, man. And each of them get a debuff of two. Now you know how it feels. <laughs> oh, that was, look at this pile of nasty. Holy moly. Oh, man. All right, head down. <laughs> Keep your head down, son. <laughs> You will persevere. Okay, so she's gonna bleed for one. She is gonna roll that at the start of her turn and get nothing. And then. Gosh, I wish she could heal. The problem with Divine Grace, no, the problem with this one is I have to heal at a range. But I don't want to. It's not even her turn, though, yeah. It's her turn, I know. I'm just thinking ahead. Yeah, yeah. 
All right, so I am going to shoot... Honestly, what's throwing daggers only six? I can't kill him without a crit. You can do it. Don't feel like using them both on one <coughs> guy. I can take one out. That's fine. Whatever. I'll use the poison dart. Good old faithful against him. Mm -hmm. Critical chance two. Accuracy ten. Ooh, luckily again. Three damage. And I'll put the blight on him if I miss with my dagger. Okay. Critical chance three. Accuracy nine okay which is another eight damage so he did he's dead <coughs> that's what you get for shooting me with that thing dude i know right okay now the vessel's turn she's gonna bleed debuff debuff buff that's a lot of stuff She's going to. She's going to heal herself. Wait. Yeah, she will. She's going to heal herself with Divine Grace. Crit chance is three, four, five. Hmm. Oh, darn it. <clears throat> She's going to heal for five. And then she's going to go ahead and do, where did it go? Dazzling lights on the skeleton. Accuracy is nine, crit chance, three. Sparkle fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Two damage. Bone rabble. And our light goes up one. And he is that hurt you, because you're nocturnal. He's stunned for a turn. It hurts me and... Makes me better. I heal two, and I lose two. Oh, it literally it evens literally out. wipes itself That's out. That's cool. I'm All a right. warrior of light sensitivity. <laughs> that's, that's what it works out. Okay. Oh, and I gotta roll my hopeless. Thank goodness. All right. So that was it. I healed a little bit. Did the dazzling light. Got the torch. Okay. That's it. Round two. Round two. Okay. Not bad, not bad. The characters have a nice progression to them uh, over one, two, three, four, five, six. They're getting slowly better and beat up at the same time. Yes. I don't think it's that. I mean, this, I don't know what it is. I think that second trip to the Hamlet where we got the free skill oh, yeah. upgrade, and then we were able to upgrade our other guys a lot. Yeah. That was kind of a turning point, because that first dungeon was like, it holy was brutal. crap. We had some bad draws. Yeah. And you had a whole bunch of misses, if I remember. Yes, correctly. I did. All right, his turn. He was stunned. He's at, That's it. Got it. Your turn. Crusader. Crusader. Bone Coder has seven. So, um, I'll move one in and smite two on him. Thou hast been smited. And that's a hit. Does nine damage, so he's toast. Nine damage. Poor dude. So I moved and attacked, so that's it. Yep, all right. Oh, so wait, I should have bled. You should bleed. That's it. Okay, last one. All right, Highwayman's turn. Highwayman will... Go get us a chest. One, two, and flip this chest over. Do we want money or provisions? Oh, that's a good question. How much money we got over there? We got 22 over there. So we're at 57. Might as well get provisions and try yeah. I think that would be wise. What kind of provision? Was it a roll one or yeah, a pick one? one? Nice. Perfect. Okay. So her turn. She's going to bleed as well. Because we're all bleeding in tandem. 
<laughs> Nothing like bleeding with your friends. And should I get the chest or should I just finish him off? Um let's see, you still you got the grave robber and then you also have the vestal, right? Mm -hmm. And then he has how much damage left? Four? Four. Is that something the Vestal can do on her own? No, without a crit. Oh yes, actually she can with judgment. Okay. Yeah, she can. Then I would say yeah, go get the Okay. She's go gonna go in there and grab a chest. We get a pick, our dice. Yeah. What do we want? Another shovel? Yeah, I'd say so. Okay. Alright, that's her turn. So the Vestal is going to first heal herself. With divine grace, crit chance. First she's gonna bleed. Lots of counters there. She's gonna heal herself. Divine Grace crit chance is five. Darn it! Heals for five, and then she's going to do judgment on him. So accuracy nine, crit chance three. Um. Actually, that's a hit for four damage, and she heals two. That's it for him, right? Yep. yep. Nice. Man, this is like. A Don't hot knife it. through butter, man. Don't say it. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna get a ghoul. I know, right? <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Hot <laughs> knife through butter. We get a. We get a curio card for somebody to use. Who's gonna use it? And are we gonna use a torch? Might as well. Um. Um. Maybe the highwayman. He's the least. Sure. It's all good things anyways, right? We got burnt torch? Yeah. So... No good roll, things. Roll, One dice. Roll, roll wow. a die. That's a lot of bad things in a disease. You know, we should give those to people that already have diseases, so that they can... If switch they have them a bad out. disease, yeah, if they have a bad one, you out. switch them out. <clears throat> Not a horrible idea. Alright, so we're ready to yeah, scout. Yeah, we've, we've got a scout. Look at my stress. Oh, one. It's climbing. Oh, two. All right, so ready? Mm-hmm. Is it purple? Yes. No. Oh, it's empty. It's empty. That means he's right there. Yep. So okay. we don't need to travel there, so we travel here. Yeah. We still got to roll the die, right? Yep. Oh, oh man. nothing. Trap. Crusader. Nothing. Nothing. Wow. Three nothings and a trap. Here, you want a shovel for that trap? Yep. Okay, that's fantastic. So we get here. Now we got to scout again. Or we want to scout again. Yeah. Oh, look at my people. <laughs> there he is. All right. All right, so highwayman. End of the trip. And crusader. Trap. Press or darkness, whatever that is. Okay. No, that's a bad <laughs> well, you can't take the trap, so you might as well break it with a shovel. Okay. Alright. Darkness. Just use the torch. Oh, yep. wait. I got a curio, too. <clears throat> we could lose a light level. Uh, yeah. Alright. Curio. Use the torch. Um. Have me a curio, please. And this is good stuff only. Positive Which is quirk. nothing a positive quirk. And that was for it's her. It's a bookshelf. She's bookshelf so full like, of old leather-bound books. She's a stress faster. If she eats food, she, she <coughs> uses a stress. Oh, I only have one food. <laughs> and then I have that to roll. Attack dice on the Vestal. Eight. What's the number? Six. Accuracy, no, accuracy, eight. Yeah, but you have minus oh, one. Oh, yeah, though. minus one dodge. Okay. So you're good. You're good. Gracias. Okay, now before we go in, we still have, what's our camp? Don't we have a camp? I don't know. It's right here. Is. Camp of 12. Yep, we need it. I need one, two, three at least. One, two, three. What do we feel like? So that's six. That's six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 
above. Sure. At least these two won't die of a heart attack just yet. Mm -hmm. All right, we are going to his room. His room is. What's his room called? What's, what number was his room? Do you remember? Is it on there? Let's see. It should be. On there. I think I. Oh, uh, doesn't say. It's got to be this one right here. That is the one. Okay. Here it is. The time. Okay, so we got the fanatic. If anybody can see that little dude, he yep. is. And the pyre. He comes with his own pyre to burn the heretics, which just happened to be us. Yes. Okay, so he has 55 hit points. The pyre has 33 hit points. Um, the pyre does 99 damage to one person in its turn when it's its turn. In its space. In its space. It doesn't walk around. Good thing. Fanatic gets three activations per turn. Yeah, so he gets um, three of these cards. Mm -hmm. That's pretty nasty. Yeah, and he is here. And the pyre is in the middle of the room. <laughs> that thing looks ominous. This <laughs> is not good. Um, he doesn't do a here. ton of damage. <laughs> he does a lot of stress. Because the pyre does all the damage. Dam well, we can break it. We can knock yeah, it down. Yeah, we can break it, that's for sure. That is definitely... <sighs> Vestal is up here. All right. And the grave robber is here. Did we need to use... Oh, dear. Did we need to use any bandages for healing before we came in here? Or is it gonna... I could probably use it. I'm at 13 out of 24. I'm at 10 out of 15. Do it. You want to take... You want to take three of these and I'll take two of them? I can actually reduce the stress if I take that. Yes. Okay, so I'll take that and I'll take two, which isn't a lot, but one, two, three, eight, and you take the other three, so we're up our provisions. We're either gonna We're all in. We're do or die. And remember we have Death's Door to work with. Okay, so Fanatic's turn. I don't even need to put him up there really, do I? He wants to do a six. Oh, he doesn't want to do a six. If the pyre is in play and there's a space in the area at the start of his turn, instead of using a skill, the fanatic will move towards the closest hero. We've got two speed. The closest hero would be, would be the him. highwayman. Yep. So he's going to come over here yep. and toss me into yep. the area of the pyre. Into the pyre. Now, if I'm still here, when the pyre goes, he takes 99 damage, which... Simply puts me at death's door. Yes. Okay. Yep. Go ahead. Don't flip over to... Well, it would be him to attack again. Because he's going to get three activations and then the pyre's sure. going to activate, right? Okay. Crusader. Um, Can you zealously accuse a pyre of... <laughs> <laughs> You're weak. <laughs> He can do it. He doesn't take any status effects. But do you call those flames? Those aren't really <laughs> flames, are they? Um. Good night in the morning. Um. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna zealously accuse the fire. It doesn't make sense, but I'm going to. Um. Uh, Ten. So it hits, takes six damage, and for my second action, I'm going to uh, heal the grave robber with battle heal. Jeez. So you heal three. Oh, nice. Gracias, sir. You're not completely worthless after all. <laughs> Alright, put that next to Mizzard. Alright. Mizzard of Guard. Number two. Oh, uh, crap. What is the he doing? The closest gonna do? person. He's running to the closest person. He's just going to keep two, filling this space. One, two. Yeah. It's her now. Mm hmm. 
That's what he does. He wants this space to be full and burning. Okay. Now, is After it full that, now? It's full now. There's three. Yep. Okay. Okay, that's his job. He throws in person number two. Now, he is going to actually act something else. He's going to do a three. He's going to do a Fury of the Righteous against the most crowded spot. Which is this. But place. he's going to aim at the Crusader, because the Crusader's in the front of the battle plan. Okay. So he needs range of one. And accuracy of 11, crit chance of one. Is this affecting the entire area? Both of them, yeah. Ten. So, dodges. <clears throat> she dodges. I'll take... Uh, how, wait, what's the accuracy? Eleven? Yeah. Ten. Um, That's it. You still take a hit. Still take a hit? Yep. Um, I'm going to use this minus one. And I have zero dodge, so I'll still take the hit. Yep. But that lets me flip that back around. So you take seven damage and one stress. Ew. <laughs> Seven damage. Uh -huh. That's not nice. The problem is, if we flip the next one... We both go to Death's Door. Yes. What? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> what are you doing to me? Oh. Oh. You. Alright. Um. You're gonna get the Vestal killed. Not, that's not your fault. One. Are you still bleeding over there? Or was that from I before? I am bleeding. But it's all good. Alright, um... So we'll go... If you don't want to get thrown in again, you... Two. I have to move out of here, though. Yeah. Saying you, he, he's going to go to the closest person now and throw somebody back in when it's his turn. Not yet, but one, two. They don't block line of sight, right? No. Unless you roll a fumble <laughs> twice. <right laughs> <That's now. laughs> All right. So we'll do this. Uh, we will do a pistol shot. Actually, should not be attacking this. Probably. To get it out of the way. I think way. we need to get it out of the way. Yeah. He's going to keep pounding on us, but I think we got to get rid of it. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here then. One, two. Okay. And we can draw a line of sight to it, so. That's a hit. I think you can miss, right? Oh, Seven damage. Seven. Seven damage. All right. Well, it is now... Thirteen. Twenty more. Alright, let's see what happens with the Vestal. Grave robber. We gotta keep the Vestal away because she has to go last every time. Alright, so the Grave Robber. So that cannot take any effects. Hmm. But it can take damage. It can take damage. Alright, well I'm just gonna throw flashing daggers at I'm going to move. I don't think I want to be the closest to it, but I, we got to protect the Vestal, though. Um, we need to make sure he doesn't throw the Vestal in, I guess, but I don't know. Maybe not. The Vestal's already in. I know. All right, I'm going to move here. No, I'm not going to move. Why am I moving? I'm going to throw my flashing dagger. Sorry. Accuracy, nine. Crit chance, one. At this? Yeah. Okay. Which is just a wimpy three damage. Put a five out there. Yeah, I will. And then I'm going to throw my dagger at it. Accuracy 10, crit chance 3. I need that crit. Oh, that's it. It was there. There yes. it is. Okay, so we both. Oh, you gain a. You heal a stress. And she does 10 damage. Is that it? It's a bad dagger, man. 20. I hope it's not. 26. <sighs> We're close. Guess what's gonna happen now? Vestal gets to go. <laughs> That's close. Vestal. Oh my gosh. 
So, who needs health? He needs health. Yeah. Oh, what's her range? Her range. Okay, so she's going to heal him with Divine Grace. Accuracy 14, crit chance 4. Not that, but from there. 5. So you heal 5. And then she's going to go right there. What? Wow, look at that. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. The pyre burns. The crusader was right for once. <laughs> Those are not flames. Okay, well. I almost broke that pyre. Man, if we'd have pulled that and dropped her right at the death door, that would have been mm -hmm. crazy. Right, here we go. His turn first. So what he's going to do is move forward. Say, so go hang out in the fire. Got it. Thirty third. Your turn second. <laughs> Thank you for putting me over there <laughs> so that I can do more damage, sir. Oh, there you go. Now, is this considered unholy? It is not. Come um, on. It sure as heck is, yes. It is? <laughs> it is unholy pyre. Sucker! All right, doing smite two. That is 11 damage. That is a destroyed pyre as it crumbles to the ground. And he lets out a sigh and a cry. And then I'm going to zealously accuse you, Cretan! I don't get a crit. Yes, I do. I do. Yes, you do. Whoa. 11 damage. And one stress relief. 11 damage. Yes. Wow. That is an accusation there. That's right, because it happened as the pyre was falling to the ground. It had a deeper, more devastating effect. Uh-huh. Nine. He wants to do a Fury of the Righteous against the most crowded spot, which is nowhere except for... So he will go after the Crusader. Of course he will. In range of one, so he'll stay where he's at. Oh, he will. Okay. Mm -hmm. Accuracy is 11, so accuracy is 10, crit chance 1. Do I have to use this before the roll or after? Do you know? You have to use it before the roll, yeah. I do. Mm -hmm. um, so it's crit chance it 11, so it's ten, it gives, gives me a chance of rolling a 10. Yeah, if you roll and a 1 through 9, right. yeah. That'd be a pretty tough one. That would have hit either way. Yep. Okay. So you take seven damage. <laughs> one stress. Seven damage. Golly. Golly, George. And yeah. one stress? Yeah. Mm. Alright. Howie. Number three is him again. And he will do the same thing. Against me again? Against you again. Oh Accuracy my 10. goodness. Crit chance one. Hmm. He's trying to pummel. Oh, well, he's oh. about to. Yeah, I know, I see it. He's 19. about to put me at death's door. <laughs> he's about to put you. Ooh, with a crit. That sucks. Okay, that's nine damage, but you're at death's door. Yes, I am. So, I'll leave these four out here and just get a ten. Alright. Okay. You're at death's door and... One stress? One stress. Alright, so that means down the rest of the line. High women. So, he, he, he was... Done. Oh, high women, okay. Um, the pyre no longer has a dice, so we're just going down the line. He'll go one, this here. Because I don't think I have... Yeah, I don't have a line of sight there. I do here, though. Yep. And so... <clears throat> do not let him kill the Crusader. I don't think there's much I can do about that. <laughs> I mean, I could go... <clears throat> no, that's fine. I, I... I, I can't get We him. need to get some heals on him, and yeah. I don't know if that's going to All right, pistol shot, 
plus one range. I don't need it though. Uh -huh. Crit one. Accuracy ten, but it's a nine, so I missed. Oof. That sucks. That does suck. That was your move and your shot. Yep. Alright, so Grave Robber's turn. She will do a pick to the face. Ah, pick to the face. Pick to the face. Should she do? Pick to the face. She doesn't mm. want to do that. I wish she could take Crusader's position. Can't. I need to back the Crusader out somehow. She's going to move over here and she's going to poison dart that sucker. <laughs> Alright, take some Blight. Three damage. Fourteen. And three nice Blights. There's another nine. He's waiting for you, buddy. No, he's resistant to Blight, so he only, oh. he only gets two. Six waiting for you, yeah. buddy. Oops, now I can't see. Okay, that's her turn. So, alright, the Vestal is going to heal you. Crit chance four. We need this. No, so that's five heals. Yeah. And then she's gonna heal you again with divine comfort. We he can't stun. He can't stun him. So she's gonna heal him again with divine comfort. Um, crit chance four. So that's four health. So that is crit. She she heals this and she heals three. I'm feeling much better. Until he comes and slaps you. <laughs> I'd like to take a walk. Alright. No more rounds. It's either him or us. Man, getting that pirate out of the way was relatively Huge. easy. Oh. But yeah, I need to boy, it kind of list. puts us yeah, be puts good. us behind the eight ball when we're facing him now with fifty five. Well, I think we can. Depends, I think we'll as be long able to as we it. stay spread out. Yeah. And he doesn't. Ha the problem is, is, if he goes and hammers the guy three times in a row, that's what's going to hurt. Mm -hmm. So that means you need to do a better job of shuffling. Look at this. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. <laughs> I even got the mark cards are marked and everything, <laughs> just so he can go first. With a nine, look at that. He's going to do the same. Dang thing. He's gonna stay right where he's at. Smack me in the face. Accuracy 10, crit chance 1. Accuracy 10, crit chance 1. Nope. You can't miss. <laughs> Alright, there's 9 damage. So that is uh, 24. That puts me at death's door again. No way. Yeah, 9 plus 15 is 24. <laughs> and you take 2 stress. Two stress? Yeah. Ouch. Are you serious? Yeah, it does. Holy cow, what is this card? <laughs> oh, snap. All right, let's see what he's going to do. He ain't done it yet. Three. He is changing up his strategy. He's going to strike the heretic, the most stressed. Oh, look who that is. It's me. It is you. Yep. Accuracy 11, accuracy oh. 10, crit chance 2. Man, well, I'm going to use the speed stone. Yeah. At least give me that 1. Oh, you got got a nine. I got to roll a 10. Come on, 10. Oh. No. All right. So now you got to roll your death door dice. That's 4 damage. Oh, come on. <sighs> okay. So you're still at death's door. Yes. You take one stun. Oh, you're resistant to stun. Mm-hmm. Um, he pushes you two spaces, and you take one stress. One, two. And I take one stress. Yeah. Look at that crusader just about it. I'm like, y'all need to go do something, because... I'm getting my tail kicked. <laughs> All right, Crusader's turn. Uh, Crusader's turn. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to be somewhat selfish and heal myself with Battle Heal. Um, let's hope we get a crit. Um, a crit three, accuracy 14. 
There's the 10 I needed. Um, but I do heal three, so. Perfect. One, no two, longer three. No longer at death's door. No longer at death's door. It's just bleeding profusely wow. out of the nose. All right, what are you going to do for your and second? And my second, see, he's one, two away from me here, right? Because mm -hmm. this isn't a wall. Right. So he's one, two, three away from me here, so I'm just going to stay put. I'm actually going to take the minus yep. one movement so I can get that back not move. and not move. Okay. Turn. Wow. Okay. Uh, pistol shot. Yeah. That's the best one I got. Pistol shot. Um, accuracy ten. That's a miss. Yeah. But that was my only. So I get a second roll. Got him that time. So seven damage. Oh wait. So he did this twice, by the way. You would have eaten those two, so you know. Six points. Yep. So that's thirteen damage between the two. Twenty-seven. So we're halfway there. Yep. Um lemon and a pear. Really? I'm in a pain. Whoa, we're halfway there. <laughs> lemon, I don't know about Whoa. the lemon in a pear thing. Lemon in a pear. I pear. Sure did, but I don't like it. All right. All right. Poison dart. Yeah, poison that sucker up. Accuracy 10, crit chance 2. Oh. Mm, three damage. And I'll give him his blight back. Mm-hmm. I can actually... Okay, that's actually 30. And now I'm going to throw a dagger at his face. So accuracy is 10, it's 9, crit chance 3. And that is, since he's blighted, that's 8 damage. Yeah, yeah. So 3. It's 38. 38. 41 on his next turn. Alright, the Vestal is going to heal someone. I don't know who, but I'm just going to heal him. For Divine Grace. For 5 health. Me? Yep. I wish she had some. I wish she had some speed. I actually might attack with her, but. She's going to do it again with Divine Comfort at you. Good chance four. Come on, now. All right, three more. That's my turn. It's his turn. He's going to do... Alright, he's going to do a Righteous Condemnation against the most crowded space. So there's no most crowded, so he wants to go after the High Woman. He wants to be two spaces away. Accuracy is 11, so accuracy is 9, crit chance 1. 9, crit chance 1. Okay, so 6, you take 2 damage and 2 stress. And he gets a buff for three turns. Okay. The highwayman looks over. What? That's not that bad? And he's like, <laughs> nah. -uh. <laughs> Don't even start. Don't even go there. Alright, well, he's at 41. He's at 41, huh? Mm -hmm. And we're going into round three. We don't care about rounds. Oh, we don't? No. Oh, All that's or right. Nothing. That doesn't All matter. or nothing. That's true. Okay. So you win or lose. 
All right. Highwayman goes first. <coughs> Highwayman goes first. Well, we'll do a... Uh, We'll just do a pistol shot. And that's a hit. Yep. So seven more damage. And you really need to be uh he's not I mean, he's forty eight. He's pumping him. Yeah, forty eight. I can't get a second attack. Stay where you're at. Yeah. Take a hit. It's his turn. Ah, 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 ah. Oh. Add three to that. Add three to that. Might as well. 51. Come on. You can do it. All right, well, it's his you turn. You need to do so one damage. Oh, it's his turn. Three damage there. So he's at 54. <laughs> out of 55. All right. And he is going to. I think he gave up. I think he just gave Dang, up. The witch is dead. He wants to attack the, the most witch, stressed. The wicked witch. That's me. He wants to go after him. He needs to be range of one. And accuracy is 10, crit chance of 3. 10 modified? Uh, yep. 10 modified. Nine modified. Nice, do it. All right. So that is four damage. Oh man, that's all. A stun for a turn, which you don't get. He's gonna push you two spaces. Uno. And give you a stress. Both. You can't get closer. It hmm. has to be away. If you can go away, it has to be away. So it's one, two. Yep. Okay. Crusaders running around like a little whip dog. <laughs> the back of the back. <laughs> Ran in the front the whole time. <laughs> All right. It's Grave Robber's turn. I think I Come will on. throw a dagger. Come on, Cletus. Come on. Accuracy nine. Crit chance three. Got him with a crit. Crit. Ten damage. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. Ow. We won. All, All right. right. Act two. Done. That is act two. Done. So what's left? We got to go to act three. Which is? Find the new baddie. Find the new bad guy. Yeah. Three rounds. Uh -huh. And then act four. Or the darkest dungeon. It's the last two. We're good. <sighs> Halfway there. So we got to do level three dungeon and boss. Uh -huh. And then... The darkest dungeon where we, we fight the darkest dungeon. The heart of darkness. Yes. Wow. We're okay. There. I I survived. have to be honest. You thought we were gonna lose. I thought we were going to lose at least one dude. I was sure it was going to be the Crusader. Got a little lucky there, but this is intense. <laughs> this is intense. We got all this crazy stuff. Goodness, going on. yeah, we got a whole lot of stuff. The beginning of the next video is going to be rather interesting as we go back to the hamlets and prepare for that trip through the third level dungeon. Well, hopefully, hopefully you guys are enjoying us. Uh, we're we're gonna keep soldiering on. Did you do me and, a favor? Uh, fix my foot. I I will Please endeavor. Give it a try. I will endeavor to fix the highwayman's foot. Right. All right. Thanks for joining us. I'm Sam. I'm JT. We'll see you guys and gals on the flip side. Side. Take care. I beg you, deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadow of the darkest dungeon.